Warren Mitchell as Alf Garnett is laying down the law in sickness and in health on BBC One. That's except for viewers in Northern Ireland who can see the programme at 11 o'clock. Here on two, we move into Top Gear. <laughs> Tonight's Top Gear, not one, but three Mazda 323s. The latest and the winner of our Rally Quest competition. And we join the celebrations for 30 mini years. Hello and welcome to this week's Top Gear. We've got the all the stars of Motor Fair. We road test the new Jaguar 4 litre and the Rover 200. We look at the behind the scenes preparation of a racing Porsche. So see you then. Until then, drive safely. Good night. Also at Motor Fair next week will be Noel Edmonds and Janet Ellis together with Top Gear's Chris Goffey and they'll be presenting special reviews on Wednesday at 7.40 and Friday at 7. Mel Brooks' brand of comic humour transfers from the large screen to the large hotel with a brand new TV series, The Nut House. That is the... Kinky. <laughs> Listen, keep a lid on it. I can tell by the looks of you, you're nothing but troublemakers here to raise hell. I've been pestered to death again by that voracious hotel chain from Houston, Texplex. Yes, big Jake Herder, right? Still making overtures to try and if buy I've us. I've told him once, I've told him a thousand times, the Nut House is not for sale. Good girl. <laughs> Join us in the Nut House on Saturday at 9.50 on 2. The nine o'clock news has just started on BBC One and here on two in half an hour, a revealing portrait of that political heavyweight Dennis Healy, the man who did the dirty work. But now on two, it looks like being another hard day's night for the police squad. Police squad in colour. Leslie Nielsen. Also starring Alan North. And Rex Hamilton as Abraham Lincoln. Tonight's special guest star, William Conrad. Tonight's episode, Dead Men Don't Laugh.